Coffin definitely has a signature look and I happen to love it. She spoke with me about her new collection, the inspiration, details, and using her signature color. The inspiration is very much an accumulation of everything that I am, which is neutral, simple, easy to live with, but it's all about texture. You know, it's about 50 pieces, but there are 800 different ways you can mix and match everything. You have a lot of pieces that have high luster, low sheen, uh, naturals. Can you talk about the mixture of material? Yes, I mean, I love Chinese lacquer, and obviously this was made in China by hand, and it's very beautiful the way it's done. Lacquering is always layers and layers, and this is thick and it's shiny and it's glossy, but what I love about it is mixing it with some of the very earthy woods. There's obviously a lot of taupe, white, black, but the combination of all the mixtures that you can change and, and move it around, I found with all the people buying the collection, they're loving that because it makes them feel like they're involved and they can make a choice. The details are beautiful. Um, can you speak to that? Well, you know, like on the top of the tables, there's this little groove, but then if you look at the mirror, you've got the same groove there or in the cubes. And what we've done is we've made all the furniture in three sizes. So people in Japan have much smaller homes. People in Florida have very big homes. So there's a real mixture, but the details are very, very subtle. Uh, one of the other details is uh, the nail head trim and how you've incorporated that throughout the collection. Yes, well the nail head is, you know, one of the things that you would use on a trunk and obviously we've gone and done the trunks in leather with the sort of signature bands, then we've done the trunks in lacquer which is a new form of, of doing the trunks, then also we've done it on the back of the chairs, on the side of the chairs, again a chair normally you look at the front of a chair and you sit on it but when you push a chair in the back's as important, so I've tried to sort of use detailing like that. We're seeing a lot of grey as a neutral, can you talk about this new neutral colour? It's different shades of taupe, which you know I've always said in all my books and lectures and everything that it's a very good neutral color for people to then add what they want onto it. But we've done the taupe colors and we've done the sands, then we've done the charcoals, the blacks, the whites. So again, it kind of mixes with whatever you choose.